Hi guys, welcome to Kumar Consulting. So guys, here in this session, I'll explain another interview question along with answer. And here the question is, I have posted a document in SAP and SAP system has generated a document number. So now you tell me, what is the document number? In the sense, which document number is generated? And here I have added one more thing, how it is determined. Of course, like when you answer something, you must have to justify also, right? So uh, again, now the question is pretty uh, tricky guys because uh, I'll tell you most of the people will say uh, the document number will be generated uh, from a number range which we have you know created or which we have assigned whatever it is but here the interviewer is asking the exact document number let's suppose if you have created a number range and you have given number range 1000 to 1999 so from 1000 to 1999 you you tell me like which document number is generated whether it is 1010 11 12 right if it is 1010, then why 1010 itself? Why not 1011? Why not 1012? Why not 1009? Right? So these things you have to justify. Now here, the best answer which supposed to be given by you people is, look at here, NR status plus one. That is what the answer given by one of my student. NR status plus one. This is what will be generated by system. Isn't it? So here, no need to say like which number is generated. Whatever number is there in NR status, in the sense number in status, right? In that system, we'll add one and that particular number is generated, right? So here, you have to, you know, explain the thing, you know, smartly. Isn't it? People are trying to check your presence of mind. Okay. Now, or is this question is pretty simple. There is nothing, uh, is, you know, the thing in the sense like it's not very difficult questions. Okay. Now, so, how it is determined, how SAP is able to trigger the, uh, this, uh, you know, document number, pretty simple is there, guys, whenever you post a transactions, look at here, the first thing is triggered by system is document type. From document type, go to OBA7, SAP will trigger the number range code here, right? So, first of all, document type, from document type, number range code, and then SAP will check what number range we have created against this number range code against 01 I have created let's suppose 1000 to 1999 right and then after SAP will check NR status also in NR status it is 1030 it means 1030 and system will add 1 in that in the sense plus 1 so the next document number is 1030 plus 1 means 1031 this is how SAP will generate a document number and this is how document number determination is happening. 